Assalamu alaikum. Hey, my dear students. What's up? My anticipation is well by the grace of Almighty Allah. All of you are welcome to NIBS Home School. This is Abhi Rosen Khan, Assistant Teacher in Mathematics at Day Shift of National Ideal English Version School. Now, I'm going to take a mathematic class for class 3. And according to last class, you know that our topic is short question. Today we learn some short question and this is our part 2. And our today's lecture is 12 and homework number is 10. And the same as class. The homework will be same as class. And this is the syllabus of half yearly. Now let's go to start our class. Question number 1. Half of rupee 24 half of 24 rupees 24 we know that half half means divide by 2 half means divided by 2 that means 24 divided by 2 if we divide 24 by 2 then it will be 1 2 ones are 2 then bring 4 down it will be 2 2 twos are 4 that means 12 therefore half rupees of 24 is 12 so the answer is 12 therefore half of rupees 24 is 12 now number second is how many hours are there from 5 a.m. to 1 p.m. 5 a.m. to 1 p.m. you know that 5 a.m. means morning and 1 p.m. means noon that means 5 to 1 that's 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 and 1 that means 8 hours therefore how many hours are there from 5 a.m. to 1 p.m. that means 8 hours now the next one is 120 minus 12 multiply 8 first of all you have to multiply 12 by 8 8 twos are 16 there is carry 1 8 ones are 8 and 1 is 9 that means 8 twelves are 96 and here the question is 120 subtract 96 that means 6 from 0 this 0 will go to 10 6 from 10 it will be 4 and you have remaining carry 1 1 and 9 is 10 10 from 2 2 is smaller than 10 so 2 will go to 12 9 from 12 it will be 9 and carry on 10s 10s from 12 it will be 2 so 120 subtract 12 multiply it it means 24 so the answer is 24 now next one I am a product one of my factor is 5 the other one is one less that means other one is one less therefore 5 minus 1 that means 4 other one is 4 and given factor is 5 what number am I that means 5 fours are 20 we know that 5 fours are 20 so the product will be 20 and the answer will be 20 4 weeks have dash days we know that my dear students one week means one week means seven days one week means seven days that means four week so multiply seven by four four sevens are twenty eight so the answer will be four weeks have twenty eight days number six what must be added to nine hundred 25 to make it 1000 925 to 1000 we have already understood that this is an subtractional problem that means we have to subtract 925 from 1000 and 5 from 0 this 0 will be goes to tens so 5 from tens it will be 5 there is carry 1 1 and 2 that means 3 3 from 0 0 means 10 that will be 7 and there is carry 1 9 and 1 is 10 10 from 10 0 and 0 that means the answer will be 75 what must be added to 9, 925 to 1000 answer will be 75 now next one how many days are there in November and December November do you know how many days are there in November 
there are 30 days and how many days in De December there are 31 days that means 30 plus 31 it will be 1 and 3 and 3 it will be 6 so how many days are there in November and December it will be 61 days now the next one one less than 5000 this is very easy one less than 5000 that means 5000 minus 1 1 less than 5000 that means 5000 minus 1 and it will be 4999 4999 will be the answer let's go to the next one question number 9 how many numbers from 100 to 150 are even numbers my dear students we know that if the ones place will be 0 2 4 6 and 8 it will be even numbers so how many are there 100 to 150 that means 100 and 150 there are 50 numbers we know that even and odd number comes one by one respectively so there will be 25 there will be 25 even numbers and 25 odd numbers so therefore that, that is 25 even number and 100 is also an even number so 25 and 100 plus 1 that means 26 numbers so the answer will be 26 so how many numbers from 100 to 150 are even the answer will be 26 now the next one how many tens are there in 7649 how many tens how many tens that means how many tens in 7649 7, so you have to divide 7649 by 10 first of all 10 and 76 it will be 7 10 sevens are 70 there is 6 and bring down 4 10 to 64 it will be 6 10 6 are 60 so 4 is here and bring 9 that means 10 fours are 40 and there is 9 so there are how many tens are there there are 764 tens in 7649 next one one score is 20 one score is 20 how many scores are there in 100 one score is 20 how many scores are there so you have to divide 100 by 20 you know that 5 20s are 100 5 20s are 100 that means there are 5 scores and the answer will be 5 this is a subtraction problem next one that means 8967 minus 5989 first of all 9 from 7 7 will be 17 9 from 17 or it will be 9 from 17 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 so it will be 8 and there is carry 1 1 and 8 it will be 9 9 from 6 will be 16 9 from 16 what will be 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 and 16 so it will be 7 there is carry 1 also 9 and 1 will be 10 10 from 9 9 will goes to 19 then it will be 10 from 19 it will be 9 there is carry 1 1 there is 9 and carry is 1 5 and 1 is 6 so 6 from 8 6 from 8 it will be 2 so the answer will be 2978 so the answer will be 2978 next one how many dozens are there in 144 how many dozens are there in 144 my dear students you know that one dozen means one dozen means 12 pieces one dozen means 12 pieces that means one dozen means 12 so you have to divide 144 by 12 144 by 12 then 12 goes to 14 in one times 12 once are 12 
here is 2 and bring down 4 that means 24 12 2 12 are 24 so the answer will be so the answer will be 12 so how many thousands are there in 144 it will be 12 how many weeks are there in 63 days in 63 days how many weeks are there you know that one week means one week means seven days one week means seven days so here is 63 days and you have to divide 63 by 7 and you know that seven nines are 63 so it will be nine days it will be nine days the answer how many numbers from 1 to 50 will have the five digit 5 in one's place 1 to 50 how many digit 5 in one's place that means how many numbers have 5 in one place look at my students here is 5 1 to 10 and 11 to 20 it will be 50 21 to 30 it will be 25 31 to 40 it will be 35 and 41 to 50 it will be 45 so how many are there so 1 2 3 4 5 so how many numbers from 1 to 50 will have that is it 5 in one's place it will be 5 so the answer will be 5 my dear students hope you understood and enjoyed the class to solve this type of problem you have to try at your home more and more to solve properly Take care of yourself. See you soon. Until then, Allah Hafiz.